this is the tool for the uh, nozzle guide vane. Uh, you might have to you might have to remake the ends or to turn this bit back a little bit further, depending on what your steps like and and how you want to locate it. But uh, again, you could turn that round and machine it to fit yours at this side. Uh, you might have to sleeve this up, or, or, to, uh, or you can't really turn that area down. Um, let me just see what it is. Yeah, funny size really. Eight seventeen point seven. Anyway, you could you could sleeve that up or put tape round, like I said, to to make it locate. Uh, this is a spinning tool for the inlet. Let us know if you don't want any of these, uh, and I won't send them, obviously. Uh, this washer could do with turning down to 33 diameter, same as this. It's just any washer I can find, really. So this will get in the way of spinning it. All right. This is the spinning tool for the front of the combustion chamber. It'll do for the KJ or the FD364 Mark Drake combustor. Um, you can see I've, I've spun one on, on this already. You might be able to make it some way to flange this first or roll this over first and then push this through with a tool or something while you're clamping a plate on here. You might be able to rig it up better. This is a tool when you you could use when you're welding. Uh, this is a tight fit in the turbine area. Uh, it keeps the shape better when you're welding. Or, or I, I, when I welded them on, I used it like um, uh, a stress relieving fixture. I left, I put, pushed this in, and then when I'd welded it, I, I got the whole body red hot. Uh, obviously, this this is like a slide hammer to get this bit out when you've knocked it in because it is a good fit. Uh, this is the same kind of thing again for the bottom. Uh, you could use it either like a welding stress relieving fixture but you, you can use your, that base I've sent you anyway. But this might do for holding the body secure and safe while you machine out um, the, the, uh, the nozzle guide, that weld that's in the way uh, in the nozzle guide bay area. Um, you could push this all the way up to stops and then grip it with your three jaws between them uh, clot your, your turbine area up. This is the spinning tool obviously for the uh, front. Now what you've got to do with this you've got to you've got to do this bit first and get, get this in as good as you can and then put this on and then you can do you can do the rad on the outside. If you if you start every time I did it, if I didn't put this on and started trying to do this bit, uh, it it pulled out of here. Now depending on the thickness material you use, you you might have to remachine inside of this. You'll have to check the metal thickness two times the metal thickness uh, of this area. I think this is 67. So this wants to be about 69 if you're using one milli, but if it, I think this was made originally for uh, 0.8, uh, so it's uh, one six bigger than that. I think that's about it. Let me know if you need anything else. Okay.